So this is Rodolfo and he's been volunteering with a broader view in Shela in Guatemala. Can you shortly introduce yourself? Yeah, my name is Rodolfo Ramirez. I'm actually from Puerto Rico, so I speak both English and Spanish. But then I moved to Dallas, I'm from Texas. And at what projects have you volunteered? I've worked two weeks here, I've worked in a health clinic and a rehabilitation center. Um, okay. And what were your daily tasks at the project? My daily tasks at, uh, at the health clinic, I used to vaccinate uh, kids, help with vitals, uh, help nurses uh, with anything, any, any job they needed to be done. Um, the rehabilitation, rehabilitation center, I worked with an occupational therapy, speech therapy, uh, physical therapy, just helping kids uh, try to get back to their daily routines. Okay. And what was the most memorable part of your volunteer experience? Um, most memorable experience was honestly at the rehabilitation center, helping, getting to interact with the kids and engage with them, helping them through their uh, challenges. You know, some people, some some kids didn't know how to control their uh, motor behaviors. And uh, just trying to help them, teach them, uh, just do s simple stuff like drawing or something like that. It was really, really awesome. And tell me about your accommodation. Accommodation, uh, I actually loved my host family. Uh, we each had different bed. Um, food was fantastic. They're really, uh, they're really sweet to us. Any questions we had, they helped us. They're very welcoming. And do you have a favorite meal that you had here in Guatemala? Favorite meal? Um, probably today, actually. We had a steak, a mashed avocado, uh, potato. It was very good. I, I really liked it. And what did you do in Shela or in Guatemala in your free time? Free time? Um, we always uh, hung out in groups. Uh, the weekends, we did some trips to like Lake Atilan. And here in Chela, we walked around and went to salsa dancing. That was really fun. I recommend it. And uh, look at museums and just explore Chela. Okay. And why did you choose the Broader View and how was their support? Uh, broader View, I really liked it because honestly, I've, I've never been to Central America, so I liked uh, Guatemala. And I actually did it through a program at AM in my school. Um, and it was a medical service trip, so I was really interested in that. And the Petra and everything, they're, they're fine, they're, they're awesome. Um, they really helped us a lot with any questions we had, and yeah. Um, and would you recommend this program to future volunteers, and do you maybe have any tips for them? Yeah, we definitely recommend it. Um, here in Chela, bring a coat, sure. Don't eat street food, <laughs> and um, don't be afraid to ask around. People are really nice here, so, and everyone will help you a lot with just any question you have. So, yeah. And what will you miss most from here? Us from here, the people actually. Like I said, they're they're really nice. Uh, the place Chela is an interesting place to do a service trip at. Um, I see a lot of things, the food, I like the climate here and everything, so, yeah. Okay, well thanks a lot and have a good okay. trip home. Thank you.